Warning, quite a few fans will be in Operation Play at your own risk. I don't have I don't have any fans in my room. Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Goron Guy123 and welcome to a night at Fanny's 2. What is this game? Let me tell you. Now the first thing that I need to tell you right now is that this game is actually made by the same person who made Fredbear's Fright. What? I know what you guys are thinking, and I'm- you probably didn't guess that. I'm- I'm like 100% sure you did not guess that. But if you guessed before I said that, then congratulations, you earned $10, but that $10 isn't yours if you didn't guess it the first time. Basically, this is the sequel to, I think, a joke game, I'm pretty sure, I'm not really sh positive, but it's a, a sequel to a game by the same name, just- it's the first game, obviously. Uh, this game looked pretty funny, though, and, again, it's made by Garrett Tube, and he made some pretty good games, like Fredbear's Fright. So let's just get started with it, and we're gonna see exactly what we're gonna be in for. If you see Fanny in the left doorway, switch on the ceiling fan by... <laughs> by pressing the space bar until it goes away. Alright, so we're gonna be using the space bar for this. Uh, activate the door light by pressing A. Uh, if Bladeon is missing from the camera screen, then switch off power generator A. If you see Hallucination Bladeon in the right air vent, when you click on it to make it go away, press D to activate the flashlight? Okay, I get it. Okay. This is actually pretty complex already. I am not sure how this is. Okay, survive till 6 a.m. So, if you can't ever tell, this is a little similar to One Night at Flumpy's 1 and 2. Alright, so what is this button all about? Alright, so I can see much better now that I brighten up my monitor, which you actually probably didn't see. <laughs> so, what's this all about, then? It's so, like, if they're there, I need to turn on the ceiling fan. And there's a hallucination that I also need to look out for as well. And there's no sounds to indicate, um, when they're actually there, so this makes it kind of difficult. So, what does this do, then? I don't know what that does, it just turns the power off. And it makes a loud sound. I've been stuffed into a fan instead of a Freddy Fazbear suit. <laughs> Let's try that one more time. I get, well, I'm not gonna. That's, just, that's not gonna end the video. I'm gonna do it more times, obviously. These deals will blow you away. Blow you away. But yeah, this place is called Fernand's Fan Shop. If you can believe that. And these fans actually come to life. Guess I just turn that on when they're there. Right? Is that what I'm supposed to do? Okay, wait. That's what I'm supposed to do, right? I have the fan on. It should be going away. Good, good, you're gone. Okay, so when is that dude supposed to appear then? So what? <laughs> the problem is that as soon as I see the instructions that I'm meant to read, I, uh, I can no longer see them unless I delete the save data. So, let me just try to study this guy's movements. So apparently he just stays there, for now. I guess I need to turn the power off when he's nearby? I imagine that's what I need to do. I guess this video is just gonna be my silly attempts at trying to not die to fans. Hey man, I'm your biggest fan! <laughs> Get it? Funny jokes, funny jokes, funny really stupid jokes. Okay, go away, go away, go away, I know you're there, I know you're there. Go away, please. Alright, as soon as he leaves, I'm gonna deal with- <sighs> I'm getting killed by fans here, you know. Also, I don't know why I have this here. <sighs> However, the hours do go really quick, so I just need to do everything right. It's a stupid game and I wanna beat it. So confident I will beat this. What? He's gone again? Okay, that's a little that's a little confusing. Confucius. Okay, oh Confuciusness. Okay, wait, what? Why are you why are you still there? Go away, thank you. For going away! Ha <laughs> ha What about the hallucination? I need to know about the hallucination. It's 3 a.m. though! We're making good progress. For sure. I do really find it hard to believe that this person can actually be killed by a fan. I truly do. And I think it's kind of sad, actually. I mean, 
you live such a long, happy life, and then you're torn up by a fan, apparently. That'd probably be a pretty brutal death, though. Just, just saying. Oh, click on- What the- what? You told me to click on it! Okay, well, I'm not gonna do all that. Again, I'm just gonna end the episode here. I don't really know if- I don't know if there's really a point to beating anyway. Maybe there will be, like, another mode of the game or something. Can I, like, click on any of these? Nope, I guess not. I think it'd be funny if you could just click on one of the switches and it turns the game off, or you get jump scared or something and it closes the game. Whatever. <laughs> That's the night of Fanny's 2. I think this is, like, the only game I can record tonight. And this might come up today, or this might come up tomorrow or the next day, I'm not sure. So anyway, guys, that's the end of this video. Until next time, ladies and gentlemen. Hey, you. Yeah, you. Thank you so much for watching my video. If you enjoyed it, please leave a like and subscribe to the channel so you don't miss out on a new video. I also have a Twitter, an Instagram page, as well as a Discord server you can join. And an Ask FM page. And if you're hungry for more Gorn Games Breathe, then check out my other videos.